welcome back to the channel. We are going to throw it back a little bit to the early 90s. We're taking a look at a car that is actually one year older than myself. Arguably, it's aged better than me. This is a 1990 Beretta Indy 500 Pace Car Edition. And this thing has been a time capsule. Uh, it's collected with only 45 actual miles on it. That's right, it's in brand spanking new condition. Uh, and it's a very nostalgic piece. Now something like this, you're not gonna win any races in, but I guarantee if you drive it down the road, you're gonna be the only one with a car like this. Uh, you know, throughout the 90s, they made Indy 500 uh, commemorative editions, no matter what uh, model it was. So they happened to do it on the Beretta. This is one of 1,500 finished in yellow. Uh, these have the black and pink Indy graphics along the side. We actually have the original uh, vinyl decals that finish the side graphics. They're still new in the plastic. They're in the trunk on these. Uh, now the Berettas weren't anything special back then, but got a six cylinder engine with a five speed manual trans. You're gonna get great gas mileage. Just a fun little car to cruise. Take a look at the styling on it. The solid one piece tail light all the way across. Uh, these do have the Indy 500 ground effects that were body matched or color matched uh, to the body moldings. So you get a rear deck lid spoiler as well as a front spoiler on it. And you have the lower ground effects on the bumpers as well and the side moldings. So this thing is a little more stylish compared to the original Berettas. Uh, we even have the original window sticker guys. So that's taped up in the side window. Now this was optioned with an actual removable sunroof. So that's right, this one piece glass, you can actually lift it out. There's a leather carrying case in the trunk uh, to properly store it as well. The wheels were part of the package obviously as well. Those were uh, body or color matched with a machine face. Those are 16 inch front and rear. And they even have the original Goodyear Eagle F1 tires on them. <clears throat> uh, also part of the Indy package was the color matched front grille. And then they do the red and black Chevy emblem. Look at this thing. The headlights are crystal clear, the fog lights, the turn signals, and everything works, guys. This thing is immaculate. It's an absolute cherry. Uh, it's just, honestly, it's captivating looking at it. It's definitely aged with style. So let's take a look inside of it. Now the interior doesn't get much more 90s than this. It's very simplistic uh, and it straight looks like it's out of 1990. Uh, it's finished in a gray with Indy 500 package on it. So you have the yellow accent stripes on the seats and the Indy logo stitched into the headrest. Uh, take a look at how simple everything is, but this thing again, showroom condition, an absolute gem. It looks and smells straight out of the 90s and brand new for that matter. Uh, these were equipped, or this one was equipped with the Beretta GT preferred equipment package. So you actually get power locks and power windows on it. The seats are a manual adjust though. Uh, you have a nice AM FM stereo system with surround sound premium sound and a cassette player. Uh, built into that is the climate controls and this even has air conditioning. So this is a daily driver ready to go. You got a five speed manual. This thing will cruise 28 miles per gallon on it. Uh, take a look at the dash. It's uh, nice and simple. And then you obviously have that digital style reading uh, for the instrument cluster. And it even has a tachometer on it. The only thing uh, that I could find to really point out, guys, is uh, the edge of the dash here is starting to lift a little bit. Looks like maybe some sun heated it up uh, and it started to lift right at the edge of where the windshield is. Uh, and then a, there's a couple small spots in the headliner that are sagging. But other than that, this thing looks and shows like new in here. And my favorite feature, the seats tilt back, so you have a tilt option on them. Man, this thing is comfortable. Now the trunk area follows the condition of the rest of the car, guys. This thing is immaculate in here. Take a look at all the jams, the weather stripping, even the carpet. Everything looks like new. Uh, there's no blemishes in here. It's one of those things you can only keep this clean. You can't make it that clean. Inside we have uh, the original cargo net still in the plastic. Here's that leather carrying case for the removable sunroof. And then the original Indy decals. They've never been put on the car. So if this is something you wanna do, 
have at it. They're here for you. Uh, under the trunk liner has the original jack and matching spare tire. That's never been removed. Obviously, that is in brand spanking new condition as well. Uh, so it just, everything's here. You're not missing anything with the car. Now under the hood is that 3.1 liter V6. It's mated to a five speed manual transmission with overdrive and everything is original in here. Take a look at the condition. It is immaculate. All the zinc coating on all the hardware still shines like new. All the belts and hoses are still original. This thing is an absolute gem. The battery has been replaced obviously, uh, so it fires up every time, but look at all the reservoirs, all the fluid is its correct colors. I mean, this thing is as close to in the wrapper as it gets. Uh, I don't know the exact horsepower on this car, like I was saying, you're not gonna win any races, but you will thoroughly enjoy driving it if that's what you wanna do with it. We are going to just cruise it around the parking lot. I don't want to put any miles on it. Uh, so real quickly, we'll just show you. It gets through the gears, no issues. The clutch is still the factory one. There's no grinds or pop-outs, guys. All the tack, or all, the, all the gauges are working on the tack. The radio works. It's actually pretty, not too bad for, uh, for 1990. <clears throat> Now just remember, if you are, if you enjoy uh, niche cars or oddball cars or stuff that's hard to find, like our stuff in our inventory, we handpick all these cars, guys. Uh, so if you do enjoy the videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you click the bell icon, you'll get notified every single time a new car like this gem gets posted. If you want to be the first to see it. Uh, you can also visit our website to see our full inventory. We got a couple hundred, both modern muscle, classic cars, collectible cars. They're all for sale. Uh, check them out at bolocars.com. Now that was my impression on this absolute gem of a car. This is a 1990 Beretta Indy 500 Pace Car Edition. Again, one of 1,500 that were produced. Uh, there's even less of them that were manual. This thing's sitting at 45 actual miles. That's right, it's never been driven, never saw the light of day, still on the original tires. If you want something that's uh, a niche car that you could collect, this is definitely a good option for that. Just something you're not gonna see. You'll be the only one with it. And if you are interested in purchasing it, you can visit bolocars.com. There, if you click the buy it now button, it'll secure a refundable deposit on this vehicle. Uh, it'll shoot us an email with your contact information. We can also help set up financing and shipping, get a low monthly payment, and have this shipped right to your driveway, uh, delivered right to your door. It's a lot of fun. So volocars.com, check it out. Or you can call us, ask for me, Caleb. I'd be more than happy to talk over the car some more with you. We can also go over financing and shipping options that way as well. Thanks for checking it out.